What's up, y'all? Welcome to Heavy Cardboard Teach, Play, Discuss, Medium and Heavy Strategy, Board Games, War Games, 18xx. I am your host, Edward Euler. Happy to be joined. Same folks as last week. It's payback time. <laughs> yeah, I'm Shrey. Gonzalo. Martin. All right. Tonight, we are busting out QE with the uh, Commodities expansion. So QE, uh, designed by Gavin, Gavin, Gavin Birnbaum, and the expansion uh, designed by Jonathan Gilmore, and this one's published by BoardGameTables.com. BoardGameTables.com was kind enough to sponsor the live stream tonight, as well as provide us with the prototype. You'll see it's a prototype. All good. Kickstarter down below. Check it out along with a host of other games that they're doing expansions for, so definitely uh, check that out if you are so inclined when we are done tonight. Um, but QE, I'm a really big fan of this game. I was when we originally got it. I don't know, five, six years ago, whatever it was, and we've enjoyed our plays of it. And if you haven't watched our stream of it from last week, definitely recommend doing so. Um, I thought it was entertaining. I, I had fun yep. with it. I think we all did, yeah, actually. Fun. And it seemed like the peanut gallery did as well. So tonight, we're busting out the, uh, the expansion. You're probably asking yourself, Self, is this a game that needed an expansion? And I find that interesting because... If you look at the strategy that was used in last week's game, I think this helps other players with against that strategy, maybe. So let's see. Let's go ahead and roll into it. All right, so Kiwi, I'm not going to do a full teach of the base game because we just did this last week, but I'll give a, a quick overview. So uh, we're printing money. Uh, we're all company or we're all countries, and uh, QE is quantitative easing. So how this works, it takes place over, I think it's 16 rounds, and one player is the auctioneer, and they are going to put up some number. Uh, they're going to put up one of four different types of industry, uh, either financial, ag uh, agriculture, housing, or manufacturing. They're going to put it up for bid. They're going to write down a number any number they want as long as it's positive and it's a whole number and then everybody else secretly will bid and then the highest bid wins that tile and then they're going to get some number of points here at the end of the game pretty pretty straightforward pretty simple the hook here is whoever spent the most money is completely out of the game you can't win so that's the hook in the base game so now let's talk about commodities commodities introduces three different types of commodities we have crypto we have oil and we have gold in addition to that, there are these little commodity uh, tiles that look a lot like that. All right, or not tiles, but like uh, roll and write type boards. material. Boards, there you go, that's the word. So uh, how this works is the auctions take place just like they did. There's gonna be 16 of these in a four player game. Pretty straightforward. First place, okay, works just like how it does in a base game. However, here, whoever is second place gets to choose uh, top deck, they get mystery meat, either the top crypto, the top oil, or the top gold, okay? And then, they are essentially buying the commodity from the auctioneer. What I mean by that is if I'm the auctioneer and Martin wins the bid, I'm going to write down the amount he bid on this and he's going to owe that or, you know, potentially lose the game if he spent too much between all of his bids, just like normal. If Gonzalo took second, I, however, am going to write on mine, on the back of this, on the back of mine, how much I sold it for. So whatever Gonzalo's second place bid was is going to be subtracted from my total bid at the end of the game. So hey, maybe I, you know, do better in that regard. But he's going to take whichever of the three commodities uh, he wants and write his bid on the underside of that. Now, these are not symmetrical numbers. The crypto ranges from zero points to 10 points. I believe it's zero, two, five, eight, eight, eight and 10. Mm -hmm. There's one 10, there's one two, there's one five, there's one zero. 
So it's a risk. It's crypto. I mean, come on, right? All right. So uh, that is worth however many points you okay, have at the end of the game. Pretty straightforward. Oil. Uh, oil's pretty consistent. Oil is going to be, uh, these are, I believe, four and five, four and five points. Yeah. All of them are four and five, four or five points. The hook on oil is whoever has the most oil commodities at the end of the game, plus five points. Pretty straightforward mm -hmm. on that one. And then gold. Gold is worth six or seven points. Unless there's a run on the gold market, meaning all six tiles of the gold are taken between the players. If at the end of the game there are no gold left over here, all the gold are minus three, which means they're worth three or four points apiece, respectively, as opposed to six or seven. There are 18 of the commodity tiles total, and there are 16. What does that mean? There will be two left over at the end of the game. All right, let me just uh, go over how this works. Whoever second place, as long as it's not the auctioneer, they write their amount on that. The auctioneer writes on the back of theirs because they sold the commodity. Okay. If the second place is the auctioneer, they're just going to draw that and write that number. They don't get a discount. They're essentially buying it from the bank in that case. And lastly, if the auctioneer wins the bid and everybody else bids zero, Everybody else gets one more chance to rebid for second place. It's any number between zero and up to a dollar short of what the auctioneer won the first place bid with. And then same thing works. Then the auctioneer will write, get that discount. The highest bid or the highest of the second places will choose their commodity after they bid. And then easy enough. If nobody bids the second time, the auctioneer takes one of those without looking at it, throws it out of the game. Whoever has most points wins minus their discounts, and that's commodities. Mm -hmm. Pretty straightforward? Good? Yep. All right. Go ahead. What happens if there's a tie for most oil, like we each get three? Uh, then it's add and divide, and if, uh, yeah, it's add and divide, and if it's multiple three or four of us somehow, then it's a point apiece for the oil, uh, additional on top of what the base is on the oil. Mm -hmm. Cool? Mm -hmm. All right. Mm -hmm. Over under Glory to Rome's four and a half, mm -hmm. and uh, 16 rounds, so place your bids now y'all all right <laughs> is that brian again running the uh, board game tables uh, chess says Let, let's shoot for some bigger bids okay uh we've learned lessons theoretically from yeah. last week we'll see yeah. uh schwazi i guess eh? and these get dealt out right oh yeah go yes. ahead and do that yeah all right go ahead and pick your uh there you go for it Okay, everybody look down real quick. Look down. That's me. Okay. And I'll put mine right there. All right, right? Hey, all right. Same number. It's, clock it's clockwise. So I am first place, or I am first player. All that means is there's four rounds uh, that start with me and with Martin. That, that's it. Um, mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, so I said four and a half, right? That feels, that feels okay. Yep. Mm -hmm. All right. Um, so here we go. The uh, actually, I shuffled these before the guys arrived. Somebody want to cut just to put it on the up and up? Go for it. Here we go. Okay. There we go. All right. First bid or first thing up for auction is a two uh, manufacturing, a two value manufacturing. Japan. Uh, Japanese. Oh, um, yeah. Uh, so okay. Let's go. Uh, let's go and start here. Forty-two hundred bucks. <laughs> That's my bid. Okay. Come correct, y'all, because I'm getting a big discount. And don't give me this five-dollar crap. That ain't gonna fly. Here we go. It's just the starting point. The amount of zeros we have. I know. Just saying that that was a much bigger start than yep. last. Yep. Okay. No, I changed my mind. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that sounded like a big, big number. Big number. No whammies. No whammies. All right, y'all look down. So everybody gets to play along with me. 
So we got that, we got that, and we got that. Uh, okay, so let me, here we go. Okay, so first place, oh, by the way, I should have written, I, I should have written it. Oh, oh yeah. My yeah. bad, my bad, sorry. Uh, that was not the highest bid. We do have a highest bid. The highest bid will come from, wait for it, <laughs> wait for it, Japan. Okay, so I will write that uh, up. Wrong. There we go. A moment. Oh, wrong pen. Oh, I, I know what I did. There you go. Okay. <laughs> Okay, so I know that amount. That will go right there. Second place was, uh, and you get that back. Second place was not you. Mm. It was the EU. Interesting. So now I get to write this number. Look down again. I get to write this number on the back of this. So here. So I'm actually uh, in first place when it comes, y'all can look now, yeah, yeah, the least commodities. <laughs> and now uh, the EU will choose one of the commodities and write this number on the back of that and keep it secret. I'm going to take crypto. Okay, and then you write that amount. Okay. I thought that had a legit shot of winning, by the way. I did. The 4200? Yeah. It doesn't uh, matter what number you write down. I, I it's, it's, it is essentially one because. Correct. Yeah. But I still thought I had a chance. I was incorrect. Okay. I finished no better than third. <laughs> okay. All right. So, Shrey. All right. We'll grab another one of these. Oop. Let's just shuffle that back in, right? Go ahead. All right, shuffle. so we have a U.S. financial okay. two-pointer. Two Let's see. So a Japan two-pointer just went for more than 4,200 and more than another number that I wrote down. All right, we will set a price at 99,000. Okay. okay. Might be of interest to the uh, to the uh, company from the US or to the Oh, because it's it's one of mine, yeah, right? The uh, yeah. Nationalization. Yeah. That amount, okay. A billion seems strong, but I have a feeling we're probably going to see some uh, some more commas in this game right. than we did the last game. Okay, um, so we have a winner, and the winner is uh, the fine country of Japan. Wow. Same strategy. Well, yeah, but I'm coming way stronger. Okay. Winning right. first bids. That one's yours. And then the second place is the United States. Yeah. So I, I write win. this on here. Yep. And then you pick a you pick something. And... Um I'll take a gold. And y'all look down real quick. So that, so prototype, but that's the number. Okay, there, okay. And then I can have mine back. Yep, right? yep, okay. good. And then- and I have to write that number. The uh, European Union wrote a zero bid. So technically, Edward, you could have gone 99,001 back. One. So maybe you did. Maybe I did. Maybe, <laughs> maybe I did. So there we go. 
so I'll just put mine right there. Okay, at least, hey, at least I won something. <laughs> my mother, my mother would be proud. So, all okay. right. Okay. Gonzalo. There we go. Oh, wow, all the twos are coming out. So, that China, is... China. Agriculture. Agriculture. Okay. And, uh... So... Let's start with uh, 165. Okay. Hmm. Expecting to win this. <laughs> <laughs> All right. We have a winner. The winner is Japan. Why not? There, there are no zeros. And we have a second place that it is. Well, you didn't write the number on it. But I, I will. Here. I, we have the answer. I trust you. Yeah. Uh, wow. Well, second place is for China. Yeah. So you need to write this number on the back yes. of your commodities. Which one you want? Uh, I don't know. Well, you write it on yours. Yep. There you yep. go. Yep. Oh, no, no. Don't write it out in the open. So what has been taken? Uh, gold and crypto. Yeah, so far, yep. Yeah. All right, let's take some oil. Okay. And then you write that amount that you spent yeah, on that. Yeah, I need to remember what I spent. Manufacturing. One. All right. An impressive one. Oh, and this is the last chance to put a zero bit if you want it. Mm -hmm. I'm assuming that number is going to tell us a lot. He's telling us a lot. Four million and one. Have a winner. The winner is the EU. Okay. So you rated on thing. that. Yep. We've got zero bids. There we go. Yep. Oh, so you're second. So I have second. Yep. So now you're going to choose. You don't get to write that on there. Okay. Because you spent yep. that amount of money. So I will choose oil. Okay. 
but I do write it here. You yes. do, because you spent that money. Yep. You don't want to be second when you are the auctioner. <laughs> Okay. So, second round. You can take that. U.S. A one-value housing. Wow. All of them choosing ones. Hmm. Good with that. Four point two million. I mean, it is American housing, and and we do have somebody going through this in our group here right now. So, uh, so yeah, that, that, there you go. Come the zeros. Were you artistic in your zero when you wrote that? I was just curious. All right, here we go. All right. That. We have that. And we have that. We have a winner, which is going to be Japan. <laughs> so I will write that amount. Hmm. Make sure I got that right. No, oh, I missed one. There's that. And so you can have that back. And uh, yours truly got it for a second. Um. Oh, right. I'll take a gold. Ah, uh, you know what? Wait a minute. Oil, oil. I'll take an oil. And that is 4.2 million, right? Yep. Done. All okay. right. Let's grab this. Hey, there's a three pointer. in China, okay. Seriously, John. Oh. <laughs> All right. Uh, uh, that's, sorry, that's... 12.97 million, is that what I saw? Oh my gosh. I, sorry, my handwriting's terrible. Let me try to make me make, make this a little bit neater. <laughs> uh. Seriously. <laughs> All right. There you go. Yes. Twelve point nine seven million. All right, let's see. Okay, all right, okay. Interesting bids. Uh, so the winner, where is the, I need this. The winner is the US. Finally! 
The good news is, he doesn't know how much. Interesting. You know it was more than Gonzalo. Gonzalo knows it was more than him. Martin knows it was more than him. That's it. These numbers are getting too big to write on these. Uh... It's annoying because I only got to like rob for one round instead of two this time. <laughs> All right, and then second place is uh, is the EU. So I'll give you back that. And you get to pick one of those, yep. and I will write this on here. But it is going to be... Uh, hmm. Crypto. And you write that number on yep. the back of your crypto. Okay. I should try to win one of these one of these days. I, I, the thing is, I've been trying. Like, I, I feel like I, I've put out legit bids. Okay. I'm the auctioner. So, here we go. Four points. Agriculture, U.S. Interesting. Let's go for... Um, Tello has nice penmanship as opposed to this side of the table. I'm just yeah. saying. There we go. Okay. Expecting some zeros. <laughs> okay. We have a winner, and that's the US. Okay, write that number on yep. there. I like corn. Yeah, yeah, makes sense. So I got this one, and I got a corn. Okay. Thank you for doing business. Okay. And uh, second place. It's for Japan. I'll take this. So, uh... You write that number on the back of there? Yep. Let me... Go Which are you going for? Go for it. Oh, I did. Yes. I did get... Thank you. I did get a uh, zero bid in the previous round. Good call. Thanks, Adam. Good looking out. Yeah, I just feel like I bought a lot of high fructose corn syrup. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. Well, we uh, let's see. It's Martin. All right. EU one corn. All right. Let's start the bidding at. I hit. We're, we're not going to have room here for the numbers. hundred. Yeah, well, you 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 can just write a hundred M at this Neither point. Neither here. Uh, yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah. Let's just. Do let's actually. I'm going to go a tiny bit higher. I'm going to go one hundred and fifty M. Okay. A tiny bit higher. Yep. Just fifty percent. <laughs>
I'm an idiot. Let me try this again. Sorry. Okay, we have a winner. That is the EU. Mm -hmm. So let me write the EU bid down. There you go, EU. We have a second place. That second place is China. So write that and write this on the back, viewers. Yep. And I will take oil. Hmm. Okay. And we have a zero pin. Okay, we start the third round. Third round. Here We're we halfway go. done. That's the halfway point. Right? All right. EU, three financial. <laughs> I'm just going to start writing a number before we start. I don't even care. What are you going to write now? <laughs> 235.1 million. Hmm. It sounded like your pen said zero. I'm just saying <laughs> zero. Okay, just saying. Okay, look down. So we have that. We have that. And we have that. And I, oh, it took me a second to get it. All right, we have a winner. The winner is Japan. I can't believe it. There's that, and there's that. We have no zero bids. Hmm. And second place is not the EU. Got it. Hey, I'll take this oil, of course. What I write here, right? I feel like it wasn't paid much for that first one. Okay. All I bought is oil. All right, let's flip another one. EU2 housing. So what was this spot that uh, EU, okay, that one. Mm. Um, hmm. Hmm. I appreciate that, Rocky. Sorry, dude. Impactful point one. Two hundred eighty-three million. Okay. 
All right, we have a winner, and it is Japan. <laughs> Surprise. You're taking it too far today. <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> it's definitely a different game. Yeah. For sure. All right, that's yours. Wow, I bet a really big number. And then <laughs> second place is the United States of America. Yeah, I reckon it was. <laughs> uh, it's like gold. Are you? No, one second. Kay. Yep, yep. You took a I gold? accidentally er erased I what you wrote on this, but I'm just making sure it still matches that, which it does. You know, I just want to verify this accidentally erased. That is. Yes. Yes, okay. Thank you. Uh, although your handwriting is as is, is, okay. is bad as mine, but yes. <laughs> okay. okay. I'm the auctioner. It is one point Japan housing. And we're going to start. Well, Brian wanted bigger numbers. I think he's gotten his wish. Like this? 475 million, that in fact is a bigger number. It's only because you started us off with three extra zeros. <laughs> it's the only reason. It's just a starting place, right? I wrote a very big number on mine. <laughs> well, we have a winner. Guess who? The EU. No? Okay. Japan. Yep. Um, oh, yes. Shoot. I forgot to write that, didn't I? I did. Um, that was... The, I took second, yeah. so... Yeah, you might write it down. Uh, yeah, I'm okay if you see whether it's a, a six oh. or a seven. Right, so yeah. that's fine. Yeah. And... Yep. Thanks, Eric and Adam. Second place, it is me, because you guys <laughs> both did. Zero and zero. See, that's a very big number. You did, and I, nine, and see, he's very German. He's just, <laughs> no humor. So, a strategy I was thinking of, and uh, maybe a tiny bit loath to give it away while well, there's still one more round, is the two points for the zero bid. If you just bid something like seventeen dollars, this would have been worth more than two points. Oh sure, right? Like, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, oh, aware, yeah. Over, all, already, yeah. yeah. So I have to yeah. pay this in order to get my um, yes. Like if you figure all three people are going to bid zero, you want to bid. I feel seventeen. Or well, you want to bid one point one higher than that, basically. If you want to. If you want this, no. But yeah. if you want second, you only need to bid like. $2. No, no, no. You, 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 need, you still need to beat the auctioneer. Unless no, they're don't. the highest. If the auctioneer oh, oh, is the, the highest. If they're the highest, yeah, yeah. Sure. Yeah. Like yeah. Oh, no. I, yeah. I thought about yeah. it. Yeah. I, I yeah. did, yeah. So I, you gotta take. You got to take gold. I've, I'm you, filling it with crypto. You got you so. to take gold. No, you don't. Oh, come on. No, you don't. You got to devalue gold. It's like, you can't just let this. How many is left in there? Four? There are four left. And there are five if auctions? If more crypto get taken, then the gold won't go away. Right. If only one more crypto gets taken, then the gold will. Okay. All right, uh, Martin, your flip. Yeah, one sec, did I erase what I put down here? And you wrote that on the back of yes, that, Yes, the crypto. Right? Okay, yeah. good. And that, that shows that. Okay, it does. All right. Have to pay for it. Okay. Uh, Japan, three, corn. So you should be very interested. 
Theoretically. Yeah, well, it's worth oh, it's four it's points plus three points plus three points. It's worth at least ten points to me. Sure. Um, and four point oh two billion dollars. <laughs> I knew that. Okay. Okay, we have a winner. It is Japan. <laughs> I'm fine with that. Um, so this is 4.02 billion dollars. Yep. Uh, one, two, three. It's Japanese, and it is yellow. Okay. All right. And who who do the zero bids? Because I think that's more dramatic. The zero bid is, is just the EU. Okay. Oh. Oh, well, we both bid zero last time. Yeah, so. I did. The person who took my advice is going to be happy with it. Which is? Second place is China. Wow. I'll totally take some uh, gold. <laughs> <laughs> and so that And write that amount on the back. Yeah. I have to make my math because a billion in Europe is a million of a million. Here is it's a it's a hundred million, a thousand million, a thousand million, a thousand million, right. yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, all right, uh, all right. Last I'll round. That's a three manufacturing, huh, for the U.S. Last round. Last four. It's also worth ten points to me. I'm just curious, like, assuming that I've spent away the most money, which I may or may not have, having seen some other bids, um, the question is, if, assuming who would win otherwise, and it looks like... I mean, if you are not the one who has spent more money, you win. Oh, clearly. There was, so our goal is to... Yeah. Yeah. But you get ahead of each other. There is that. Yeah. Yeah. And the only way you're gonna like the only way Shrey is gonna catch up with Edward or Gonzalo is if he outbids me. Mm -hmm. Otherwise, he's just gonna flat out lose. So this is what number was written down? It's, it hasn't. Okay. It hasn't been. Three point six five billion. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Alexander says, but somehow this makes me worry about the 93 Kickstarter backers who chose the highest pledge level and may or may not find out that whoever pledged the most of anyone loses and gets nothing <laughs> after all. I appreciate that. All right. Okay. We have a winner. It is... China. Ooh, I want something. Uh, give me that real quick. Hold on. You did, in fact, win. Okay. It was manufacturing, right? Uh, it was. Yeah, okay. So you get that. Second place goes to the EU. So write that number. Behind right. crypto. I stand touched to crypto. Oh, thank you. Oh, you gotta kill the gold. Well, I don't know. I, I like uh, if I get a second, I'd be fine with it. Five points each. Uh, gold is six point five each, and it's now not quite impossible for the gold to go out. But yeah, but I don't know why you want to take the extra point. Uh, it's me. Yeah. All right, can you flip one for me, please? Yeah. Japan for housing.
All right, $4.8 billion or yen or whatever, currency unit. Okay. When I won this, I forgot to write on the back of it. We'll have to come for second place. It's one of the second. No, that's not. No, that's one of the, it's not one of the second place ones. Well, it wasn't me who forgot to write in the back of it, then it was whoever did the auction. Okay. Hmm. Do you remember what it was? About? You three. No, I don't remember. But the, the peanut gallery can tell us at the end. I don't know if they would have seen it. I don't think they it. will have seen it. Oh. That's uh, all right. If it was me, they will have seen it because I would have written down if it was my own. If it was someone else's, then, yeah, then they won't have. Yeah. Um, if it comes to it, we'll we'll, we'll try yeah. and figure that out. All right. So the four point eight billion is the. Yep. I was trying to get an idea of. All right, we have a winner, and it is the United States of America. I need this. There you go. All right, that is yours. And then second place is the European Union. Oh, wait, why am I erasing yours? I don't know. I erased yours. <laughs> uh, so you so you pick one of those. Yeah. All right, do it. All right. Well, that makes me happy. Okay. So my thought process is I could go to a value minus what I have here and still be good. All right, know the number. Yep. <laughs> okay, China. All right, penultimate one. China, another four points, housing. That's a big number. Struggling with whatever that is. I don't understand this. Sorry. That many? Yes. Plus that okay. many. Okay. <laughs> I just thought I didn't want to write all the zeros. Sure. There. Yeah. We have a winner that it is. Uh, China. And second place, it is for European Union. Okay. Mm -hmm. So, this is yours. Yep. You need to write yours. this on the back of yours. No, he writes. Oh, no. Oh, no, European no, Union. Have to, yeah, he oh. has to pay for that. Yeah. You, oh, I, I, sorry, I heard, I heard yes. US. Okay. So, I'm not getting. I'm not getting crypto. Yeah, it's five player only. The UK is. I'm getting gold. 7.5. Oops. Mm. That is possible. 
but I'm banking on the answer being no. All right, everyone should know what this is now. It, theoretically, <laughs> but yeah. it's, 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 I am not taking that in the country. It's Japan, no. Yes, Japan. All right, we ready? It's no. EU no. One, two, oh, four. four. Yeah. yeah. Look at them. Yeah. Okay. I'm just glad that Martin ends this. This is important. Did I you, could politic things, but did I'm you, not gonna. Did, did you already yeah. place a zero this round? No, he has not. Well, I mean, he cannot make it now, but... Right. Yeah, that's what I thought. 15,000. Cheap. Yeah, it's for four point or two. Hmm. How much was that? I mean, if you still got like four billion in refunds, you can still spend three billion. Understood. Okay, let's see. My goal, I'm shooting for second, is what <laughs> I was shooting for. All right. We've got a winner. It is China. Okay. Oh, i got to write this number yes. one. Yes. Uh, no, uh, hand me the box. We've got a... Second place, it is the EU. The EU, yeah. So, yeah, uh, the UK is five flare. That's all. It just comes into play. That's all. I'll take gold. gold. Damn it. And the US did not even grab their two points. We did not. We, we gambled. We gambled, yeah. I've, I did the same thing a couple yeah. times. Yeah. It worked once and didn't work twice. Yeah. yeah. All right, everyone got their n numbers. All right, so add up your stuff. So what do I have here? I have 11, 3, 6, Four, five, six 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. So that's right. Oh, and I had housing again. I had manufacturing. Agriculture. So where do we want to put the... Um, hold on, hold on, 17, 18, 24, so I'm at 24 there. Okay, so now, so like crypto, I got zero. Oil, I got uh, four. And then obviously Shrey's going to get the plus five because he got the most oil. Yep. And gold, I got 13. Yeah. And my discount, oh god, yeah, it's, one in it's not really going to matter, but... Uh, yeah. it's, almost, it's almost pointless to add up the things that don't have B's on them, right? Like, fair, but... Yeah. Um. These aren't mine, these are unspent ones. Um. Alright, so now we need to add up all of that and then subtract. Discount five hundred and seventy million. Oh, I'm sorry, no, this is additional cost. Sorry. <laughs> so he puts. Uh, I don't know how to do this. Hang on, yeah. Mm. 
My calculator won't you let me do billions. That makes me sad. All right, fine, I'll do it. I'll eyeball this. Oh, God, the kids would be disappointed in me. So let's see. Uh, 7.5. Plus another, or 0.5. So Seven, 8 billion. Call it roughly 8 billion. Yep. And that's about five. So I'm at like oh, about three billion total. About. Oh, I didn't take the discount off, but I'm about 7.5 billion total. Yeah. Okay. You seriously need a bigger calculator. I spent way more than you all. Really? Yeah. Seriously? Yeah, no, I spent 14 alone right there. Holy cow. I spent, I, I, I won too much at the end. Yeah, that's what, I don't which is what Ma 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 Martin was betting on. It's right. always just going to go up and up and up. And once I saw that, well, I knew what the total of these was, and once I saw one bid higher than the total of what I spent. Eighteen point nine billions. Oh, <laughs> yeah. yep. I spent the second most. I spent the third most. So, so I got the six extra points. Yep, I do. So I'm looking at forty-seven all day. I'm looking at fifty-four. Oh, so I need to add that and that. And so. so Gonzalo's out. But what would you have had points-wise? Well, six, seven, eight, nine, uh, twelve subtotal uh, plus. 44. That's 56. 56. You had more points than I did. Yeah, so 56, but out of the game. Yep. Shrey? 49. 49 in the game. 47 in the game, and your winner, 54. 54. So that was definitely closer. That was way closer yeah. than, like, than last game. I got to Rob for one round, and then you guys caught on to, caught on to it. And we, we, we thought we were doing it, and then we, <laughs> we weren't. And then and again, we, yeah, I wasn't caught. Yeah. One who spent more. Oh, apparently I could do it sideways. Okay, the calculator allows billions. Oh. One, two, three. One, two, three. One. Oh, yeah, it, it really does. Okay, good to know. Okay, all right. I, I knew whatever your first bid was, it didn't matter whether it was $5 or 5000 it was add two zeros to win the first action, and then only you would have that information that I was two zeros ahead of it, and Shrey wouldn't, so that what Shrey did, I would need to at least maybe add one more zero after that to stop you from winning the second one, and then only Shrey would have that information, and you wouldn't know I went up by a whole multiple of 10, you might have thought I doubled or whatever, right. knowing full well that we'd have four or five extra zeros by the, the fourth or fifth round. You, you manipulate that well. Yeah. We're learning. <laughs> Not, we didn't win. But we did. We're smarter than we were last game, but still not smart enough. But getting there. But <laughs> probably two more plays. I think we'll catch up, and then Martin will just completely throw a wrench into plans. There's that. All right. Well, there you go. That's uh, that's QE's uh, QE and commodities. Um, so it's sponsored. So we're not going to do a roundtable. But I, I I will say that I found it. It, it definitely rounds off the things, and I think it, I think it kind of, I don't want to say solves, but kind of the, the, the problem that we ran into without the expansion. So I would say well done on that. So if it's something you think would be a good uh, fit for you and your game group, then uh, check out the link down below. Certainly would appreciate it. Uh, congrats to Martin. Thanks to everybody here. Thanks to you all for watching. Thanks to BoardGameTables.com. Providing us the prototype as well as sponsoring the playthrough. Like, subscribe, consider supporting the show. It helps keep the lights on here. Certainly would appreciate it. We'll be back later on this week. Some other stuff coming for y'all. I'm Edward. Trey. Gonzalo. Martin. All right. Y'all have a great night. Take care. Thanks, everybody. We'll see y'all later on this week. Good night, everybody. Yeah. We were, we caught on. Yeah. No. I thought we were doing better. A little bit too late. Yeah, just too slow on, on... I didn't do it in the first play, and I was like, I have to do it in this play, that it is sometimes checking how much I've spent. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Because you lose the, it, it, how much it, you yeah. spent. Oh, it's a credit card. I don't need to pay that. <laughs> yeah.